What are green buildings? Those buildings which are constructed under the consideration of sustainable construction development. Here are some examples of green buildings. The Museum in uh, Anhiero, Brazil, Museum of Tomorrow. The Pixel Building in Melbourne, Australia. And the One Central Park in Sydney, Australia. And in the Middle East, there is Bahrain World Trade Center. In the Vancouver, Canada, the Convention Center. The History, 1993, Rick Pedirizzi, David Gottfried, and Mike Italian established the U.S. Green Building Council. Their mission is to promote sustainability in the building and construction industry. U.S. Green Building Council, or LEED, leader, leadership in energy and environmental design lead is a green building certification system which working in united states and us will all all over the world usgbc created rating system which is nationality which is nationally accepted as standard for the design construction and operation of high performance green building why so much, so much interest in green construction? Sustainable development has become a global issue. Global climate change has become an increasingly serious concern for the future. Concern over the impacts of built environment on natural environment, economy, health, and productivity. Merits Lower operating costs by 30 to 40 percent improve occupant health reduce pollution reduce water usage by 20 to 30 percent eliminates creation of waste reduce power consumption 40 to 50 percent elements of the green building sustainable seating and design water quality conservation energy efficiency resource efficient materials healthy indoor environment quality Sustainable seating and design, appropriate building site, preserve open space, reduce urban sprawl, develop brown fields, use of demolished material in landfill, design to optimize use of sun, wind, and air. Sustainable seating and design. From many aspects, it can be examined with respect to how green, architecture for people and environment the home on site can potentially be open space is open piece of land that is developed and is accessible to public public parks community and gardens open space provide recre recreational areas for residents and helps to enhance the beauty and environmental quality Urban sprawl is refers to migration of population from populated towns and cities to low density residential development. Urban sprawl is cutting into precious farm and wildlands, leaving us with less green space, precious wildlands, 
the most obvious problem is that sprawl leads to car dependent culture. Materials used in green constructions Wall brick obtained by adding wall and a natural polymer found in seaweed to the clay of the brick. 37% more strength than burnt bricks. Resistant for cold and wet climbing. Sustainable concrete, crushed glass, wood chips or slag. A byproduct of steel manufacturing reduces the emission of CO2. Solar tiles exist to simply protect a building. They spend a large portion of the day absorbing energy from the sun. Paper insulation made from recycled newspaper and cardboard and filled with chemical foam, insect resistant and fire retardant. Triple glazed windows Super efficient windows stops heat to enter the building and from direct sunlight. Eco-friendly using bamboo replacing the steel bars. Merits and demerits of green building. The merit of green building, efficient technologies, easier maintenance, return on investment, improved indoor air quality, energy efficiency, water efficiency. Waste reduction, temperature, moderation, water conservation, and economical construction for full, poor and healthier lifestyles, recreation, and improved health. The demerits, initial cost is high, availability of materials, need more time to construct, need a skilled worker. Okay guys, that's it for today and don't forget to answer questions at the end of this video. I'll see you on our next topic by next week. Thank you so much.